Now, welcome to another John Graves show. Today, I'm bringing you some news on something that kind of does hit, hit a little close to home for me. It's actually, um, uh, one second, Richard, Richard Hill Whitehall, I think that's his name, um, the uh, creative director for Super Icon, um, I mean, uh, the creative director at Super Icon um, uh, was in was in development for a beta game called Indoor Pub uh, Indoor Pub Game Sports uh, Sports Sports World, which which based on the title, I would assume that it's about a game which is all these mini games of which that things that you can do at a bar, pretty much like like beer pong and darts and so on and so forth, playing playing pool and everything else. See, I see, I can kind of see that. But um, from what they kind of explained was that the Vita, or at least like their um uh, development for for working on the Vita while I, while actually trying to while trying to um run their while trying to manage their own engine and also trying to develop to uh, develop their own game for it, um, they ended up kind of having a a really bad um. A really bad experience working with like two of these things, and pretty much it kind of did. Uh, it kind of backfired on them, like in the end, solely because uh, Richard kind of stated that um, working on the Vita pretty much like ruined his um, ruined him fi- um, uh, financially. So give or take with that, it was like yeah, man, working with the. Um, Working with trying to build your own engine and also trying to make your own game, um, it kind of didn't work out as well as he thought it did. So, you know, he kind of had like had like a good idea, but then it was terrible solely because everything was wasn't working. And you know, however, pretty much there was a um, um uh, and also it probably was uh, it really wasn't helped by um uh, the fact that that all of their um uh, that all of their play tests were pretty much like um said that uh they needed like they had like must fixes in them and then pretty much you and then pretty much it sort of felt like uh Sony was just was just delaying the games that they were like putting out so however however there is a silver lining in this pretty much that something that uh, I learned back in my days of game developer school was uh you gotta use those third party engines. You gotta you you gotta use things like Unity and UDK and stuff like that. And pretty much that's kinda what uh he learned from it was like pretty much if I'm trying man to do my own thing and I can't make wages, I can't make I can't make any money basically like trying man to like getting all this done and sell my stuff, then pretty much I'm gonna have to like cut down on time somewhere and start using like free programs and start and start and start doing that to sort of like push the time out so I don't gotta eat up all my stuff. So pretty much, hey, there is a silver silver lining in it, but at the same time, this is one of those stories that does kind of hit hit home with me because it's like you put your all in um uh, into something like a world like a world design document you can put your all in animations you can put it all into game development you can put it all into basically trying to get all the uh, mechanics work getting the UI working and all that but at the end of the day it's like the company in which that um you are you are trying to pitch your games to pretty much can just like eat away your uh, time or pretty much you were trying to like do something good with this program and then it just turns up and fails so you know for me that kind of hits that uh, for me that kind of hits way more home for me because this because this is one of those stories which pretty much it's like well yeah well yeah you know I kind of man like try man to like do something good but then it kind of like ruined my ruined my relationship with this with this company which that I kind of was uh, devoted to so so hey what do you guys think of this topic please tell me down um, uh, below keep um uh keep playing those video games keep watching that anime and I'll see you guys on the next John Graves show I'm out and hey have a good one all right